Hi guys, you can't see my face, but this is Tristan here, and I'm coming to you from World English School today with a fun toy. And this one is like a labyrinth toy, and I'm not sure exactly what the name is. I think they're made under all different kinds of names, but the idea is you have this marble here. It's a little steel marble, as you can see. And you start where it says start here. I don't know if you can see that. And then you can see that the arrow goes all the way through like this. And then it goes past all these numbers. So see like number one is here, number two, three, four. So um, the idea is that you have to make it as far as possible along this track without falling into the holes and then try to make it to the end. I remember the first time I saw this, this was at my um, friend's mom's work and she worked at a paper company and she had this thing and um, yeah I remember playing with it and just loving it Whoa. so you can see that I'm trying to avoid the holes here and I'm following this line here so you can kind of use the walls as a uh, safety see how I'm doing that See if I can do it here. And maybe, ooh, look at this. I'm doing it. This is a hard part. Look, I have to go between these holes here and then to that corner. I could cheat and go this way, but I don't think I'm gonna cheat. Wow, I lost. And then what happens is that there's a little hole over here. Um, I can't show it to you because I don't want to move the thing, but yeah, there's a hole over here that the ball comes out of. So I'm gonna make the ball fall out. This is the, I only have one of these marbles here. And then I think I'm gonna go, go ahead and switch this. Let's do a different one. I wanna try the different ones. And now you can see the inside of this. And now look at how it works. Isn't that simple though? Look, there's just springs here, two springs, and then steel rods or aluminum rods. And what happens is that the string from the dial here twists the string back and forth and it causes the different movement. Why don't we try the baseball one next? Here's the baseball one. This one, I don't think I've ever tried the baseball one. I've only done the classic. Okay, so, oh my goodness. <laughs> Can you believe this thing? Look at this. So we're gonna start on start, and we're gonna have to follow this line as closely as possible. And we're gonna have to follow all around to first, second, and third base, and back to home base. So, I'm gonna put that there. All right, start. Here we go. I'm gonna have to be very careful. Wow. Look at this. Isn't that crazy? Oh, and I already lost. <laughs> that didn't last very long, did it? Let's try again. Let's try one more. This one was a fun one. It's hard though, really hard. Okay, so you have to make sure this one's even when you start it. And it's not even. All right, I think that's good. Oops. Okay, here we go. Okay, we're gonna try again. Ah, it's like I'm kind of going off the line, aren't I? I don't know if that's cheating or... Ah, there we go again. Last time I fell in this hole, this time I fell in this hole. So I guess I did a little bit better. All right, and then should we try one more? Let's try one more and see how I do this time. Okay, so again, even it out. This one has to be really even to get the marble. It's not even yet. But now, all right, I can move it here. Okay, I got the marble. Okay, now we're on the pitcher's mound. Oh, I almost fell in. Okay, I'm gonna go, I'm kind of cheating a little bit because I'm not exactly following the line. Ah, man, this one's hard. This one's too hard for me. I think this might be the biggest challenge. I don't know. Okay, so we're gonna take this one off. I like to put my finger through there like that. Look at the bottom of this. It's just a kind of a lightweight wood. Okay, and then let's do the last one here. This is the golf one. And I like this one too. Although, like I said, I, I, I've only tried um, the, um, the classic version. So I've never done the golf version. And let's get this in here. I think it's a little bit, is it in there? I feel like it's not completely in. Got to make sure it lines up so that it's in the correct place. All right, and this one's got a little bit of dirt on it, as you can see. See that? So I'm going to have some, it's going to be like real grass. 
this one. All right, so we're starting from par one over here. And in golf, um, the idea is that you, um, yeah, you try to get uh, uh, the ball in the hole in a par, what they call par, under par, if you can. Um, so if you can do this in par one, that's that's the average. That's what the goal. So let's see if I can do it in one par. Oh, 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 oh. I did it. Look, got it. Okay, par one finished. Uh, this I think this is already my favorite. I like it better than the other ones. The classic's okay too, but that baseball one was hard. Okay, let's do par two. Here's par two. Okay, this one we're gonna have to be careful, right? Because we're going around through here and then up. Okay, let's go very slowly. I can already feel like I don't have the control. Can I do it? Cheer for me. <laughs> ah, I couldn't do it. Let's try one more on par two. Par two is, is maybe much more difficult than par one, isn't it? Okay, here we go again, par two. Here we go. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna concentrate. Oh, 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 ow! Oh. <laughs> Man alive. So I don't know if, um, you know, how young a child could be to play this. I mean, you could probably be five or six years old if you're good with your hands, but yeah, this thing is, is not easy, you know? So, but it's fun. I, I've always loved this toy. I've always enjoyed it. Um, yeah, I just think it's so cool. Um, and I think you can get it pretty much anywhere. I've seen it, I've seen it um, sold under different names before. So, um, yeah, I think I, it's called Marble Labyrinth or something. I, I'll put the name of it if I can on the uh, description here. So anyway, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna start again. I'm gonna do this the other way this time, closer to me. And um, as I finish this last game, I'm gonna say goodbye to you. And <laughs> I already lost. And uh, thanks for watching. Yeah. So anyway, this is a, a really fun game. Um, and uh, yeah. Take care and thanks for watching. Bye-bye.